hi guys welcome back to another video guys i was here chilling and i oh here you are face to face in this trashy bar another glass and i am going places makes me laugh so yes guys i was here and i remembered something that had happened to me in the past okay so I decided on sharing it with you guys. I want to talk a lot, talk up so you guys can hear me. Somebody was passing. So guys, I remember once when I was in Jamaica. So this is basically a story time again, guys, because so many things been popping up in my head. And I said I have my channel, which I'm a CEO of. Can I get a walk? Wow. So I said I'm going to share it with you guys. So, I mean, why not? i have a platform where i could put certain things out to you guys so you guys could interact with me and let me know what's up if you like it yes or no da 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 so as i said i was in here chilling and i remember that time when i was back in jamaica guys oh i got scammed could you believe it i got scammed so i'm gonna let you guys know about the story and how it happened when it happened and stuff like that so guys i was living in kingston guys because i'm a girl that you know i'm a country girl leave kingston sorry leave country to go and live in kingston because nothing that really are going in a kingston in a country not the country area it's slow no biz well they have businesses but it's slow work is so hard to find over there and all of that thing all those all those things you know i'm hot so um i leave country and go and went to live in kingston so from there you know i started to spread my wings start to work start to do all kind of stuff you know meeting all different type of people which was good i end up in a very nice i got a nice job which I held on for many years. Guys, a lot of things I've been through, you know, growing up, good and bad. But I always choose the good side of life. You understand me? So, while I was in Kingston, you know, working, saving my money, and all those good stuff. While I was working, I I needed change. Like I need, I wanted to do something else. I wanted to explore. I wanted to have better, you know, get better opportunities and all of that. So, you know, I'm while working, searching for a better life, be, better way of living you know so while working i i um i was looking for like jobs overseas because there was a lot of overseas job in the gleaner in the newspaper on the social media but social media wasn't all that you know out there but it was there but people wasn't gravitated to it like no but while I was there working in Kingston, I was trying for, you know, to be abroad then, to go abroad, to come up either America, England, Canada, anywhere out there where I could better my life or get better opportunity. So, um, I saw this thing. What, did I saw it in the paper or somebody, it was this girl. I don't want to call her name. I don't like to do that this girl I'm gonna say this girl because I can't think of a name to call her this girl introduced me and another girl about an overseas program so you know as I said you girl want to want to um, explore experience you know another way of you know life can make more money to you know supply for me and my family and all of that so um i was so interested 
So while I was working, I I was throwing partner. I was throwing my little partner because I always love to save. In Jamaica, we call it partner where we give a person an amount of money. Like me, a week time, you would, they would say, okay, you're going to give us maybe a thousand dollar for a week or two thousand dollar for example and you get your money so they you get your money every week so one person will get a draw every week or da 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 down until it finished so i was in the partner i get my draw during the time i get my partner draw i get my money during the time the person told told us about this um program so i was saying yes i'm excited now Yes, I'm going to go on a work program because people was trying to get out, get, um, to go on programs and all of that. So I said, yeah, I'm going to try it because I really want to do something else. I want to make more money. I want to explore. I want to, so, you know, so I said, yeah, man, I'm interested. So she tell me, she told me where I should go and all of that so I said okay but the program that we were we were supposed to go to a small island I think it was the Bahamas yeah Bahamas it was supposed the program was going so because I said yeah I want to go I'm excited the girl the girl told us that um, the people the whoever organized the program um, we we're gonna meet them they're gonna come to my job because because it's somebody that then the girl knew the girl knew she's gonna come to my job wherever I work I was working in New Kingston so she told us that they're gonna come and we're gonna meet them outside meet them outside um, wherever I was working so I say, yeah, man, I'm ready. Come I have my money. Get my little partner, draw me excited because me I go get me I go try something else, something good. So I say, yeah, man, I'm ready, man. What do you mean? Anytime they come, I'm ready. Cause I want to get out of this place. I want to try something else. Cause at least I was working and the money was kind of can't help me out when I was back there. But I said I still wanted more. So they came. I think it was an hour was on a Wednesday can't forget the day it was on a Wednesday yeah and it was a day like this sunny nice good day so she said I could go out and meet them by the gas station oh my god the gas station on Trafalgar Road in New Kingston I can't forget right across from this this the supermarket so I said, yeah, man, can't meet them out there. So I went out there. They came into a car. And I remember the color of the car it was a gray car. I think it was a Honda. I said, yeah, man. So I went out there and I meet the lady. It was she and another lady. And I think a man was driving the car. But because this girl introduced me to them and she was working with us, I said it must be legit because if it's somebody she knew and we work together well at least we can you know go ahead and do it because we will want to try something new I've got our time now because I some time for me leave so um I went out there meet the the woman women because it was two women and a man driving and I said um I introduced myself Da da da, and they explain to me and tell me oh, um, how much it costs. And in me, in my head, I was so excited. It's not like I was slow or anything, you know. <laughs> Excitement take me over me, I tell you guys. Excitement, and then I said, I know the girl who introduced me to them, so I wasn't even thinking about anything negative or anything like that. So I was like, okay, then. I have the money XYZ and I gave them the money and they told me that we gonna leave we're gonna leave the Sunday the Sunday in the same week 
we're gonna leave they're gonna get things started because i i was so i don't even know what i don't know as i said i was so excited so she she told me that we're gonna leave this sunday and i gave her the money and i remember she wrote it on a receipt so the receipt that she wrote it and gave it to me gave to me that alone to the kind of let me don't look at anything like they were scam, scamming me or anything like that because i'm saying okay so I legit card then write receipt give me <laughs> so anyway i gave them the money them give me the receipt and i went back to work the other girl that signed up with with them as well to how we come back now we start to talk how much we sign up on program and we were worrying about our jobs our um, supervisor manager and everybody because i mean i i was so concerned about my job because i'm like oh my god this is where i'm working for so long and then we are gonna leave them i wonder how oh, them are gonna cope with us gone leaving and all of those things and then we start to say yeah we're gonna plan up now and getting stuff together because they told us we're gonna leave the sunday and we start to make big plans guys backside so i think this friday we start calling the people on phone to hear get more info on where we're gonna meet up how this thing gonna go guys I call till thy kingdom come. Not even one answer. Them people them not answer me. Them not answer we. Because we me excited to me all go far in, you know. Come it done pay me money and well sort out everything, you know, and say, yeah, we're gonna leave the Sunday, guys. Them scam out with money, gone with it. We couldn't do nothing at all. The girl that me and her sign up on, her family been calling me, asking me all kind of questions. The same girl that introduced um, us to them, they were asking them a lot of questions too. She talking about how oh, they scam her, the same, they did the, the, the same thing to her. But in my hand, they had a girl head. All we were saying, I, I, I think it was that girl who, who she and the other people who take my money, she and them plan up and do that, guys. And they use her as somebody that we knew to you know talk to us for us to believe that it is it was a legit legit thing so because of that no they they, they the people them scam we ain't with the money you see from that i would never ever say i'm gonna sign up for another program never because i can't forget the time that happened to me jesus christ you see enter your one good a lot of things always come your way guys and you have to be careful have to be careful in this out in this world because people is not real a lot of people is so negative and they 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 them them wicked 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 people them and i think it's because the girl knows say i get my little partner draw my little money when me save up and me get it she got introduced the people them to me and that's how you know she would be able for them to take away my money just like that they scam me and take my money like come on that was so so i can't forget it up until to the day because i wanted good for me and my family um you know get a better job or better you know and them take away my money just like that yeah it is just cruelty I was so mad. I met, I'm telling you guys right now, I'm looking at it and I say, oh my God, look, oh, them just come and take on my money just like that. Guys, if you made it this far in the video, please subscribe, like the video, share me out if you can, because I want to reach out there in the YT world. Because the more likes I get on my videos, the more it's get to be out there so other people can see it and react to it, comment to it or anything like that, guys the good things them so yes guys you have to be careful out there in this world because there's a lot of wicked people out there people who don't want to see a prosper in a life they see you trying and then just send the devil to come and take away everything from you or distract you from certain things so big up on yourself thank you for watching appreciate the love and the support as always